وإذا سألت فلم تجبك طلولهم Islamic Spain, Al-Andalus, has been described as the melting point of time and space, as the great crossroads, as a vast synthesis, as a major threshold behind the European Renaissance. We will travel together and learn about this remarkable cradle of civilization. Seville, Ishbilia, we will learn about the Terra de Oros, that great tower, the Burj of Dhab, the golden tower on the banks of the Wad al-Kabir, on the banks of the Wadi al-Kabir, used by Muslim emirs to keep an eye on any incoming enemy. And we will learn about the high points and the low points of that great Muslim empire, that great Muslim civilization, about the power and the strength in unity and about the weakness in division and Seville becomes to epitomize those Ta'ifa kingdoms, the petty kingdoms that fractured and fragmented the strength of that Muslim empire. And then to Cordoba, the land of a thousand lights, in fact the land of 10,000 lamps and 600 mosques and 500 libraries and 50 hospitals, the land of convivency, of the coexistence of Muslims, Jews and Christians and of art and culture and civilization and learning and discovery and of science and then to that great palace the Alhamra in Granada described as a pearl set amongst emeralds and then finally to the Al-Pujaris mountains difficulty and struggle had beset the Muslim Ummah in Al-Andalus the forced conversions of Muslims to Christianity led to this band of Muslims called the Moriscos having to hide out in those mountains, we will see the landscapes and the sites, we will see the mountain tops and the caves where Muslims held on with their faith in those dark and damning days of the Spanish Inquisition. Join me, Dr. Uthman Latif, as we travel together with Tazkia Tours to Al Andalus, the cradle of civilization, this coming October. <laughs> Kun